Hey guys, DTC here, and I hit the 100 subscribers mark, and yes, I mean, there's not going to be, I'm not going to do anything too special, but yeah, as you know, I have done a lot of Brave Frontier on my channel, and I hope to keep doing it <coughs> if I don't go broke, <laughs> but yeah, but technically, what I'm going to do for my 100 subs is my Brave Frontier story is how I started playing. Yeah, so the squad you're looking at is how I literally, like, this squad was how I rolled. Except Bonnie was 6 star and Selena was 7 star. It was before Omnis came out, before Bonnie's 7 star came out. Yeah, but technically, <sighs> my very first story is pretty funny how I started. Yeah, so my very first unit I summoned was... Where is she at? At Lancia. <laughs> I did use Lancia for quite a while. And then I stopped using her because she started to get unviable <laughs> for me. But then again, yeah. And then I still remember my next two. My second summon was Totetsu. And he was my leader for such a long time, man. I mean, yeah, before Haley came out. Yeah, that's how long it was, because I had Totetsu as my leader the whole time, and then when Haley and Corzon came out, Haley just took over that leader spot for a long time, too. And then Bestie, yeah, Bestie was my third pull. I literally put her in every squad, because I needed the BB Gage stuff. But and then that's when uh, LaFille came in, and... Yeah, it just took over that spot and also took over Krantz's spot because I also had Zoraya too, so I already had all six elements, so eh, Krantz wasn't really helpful much, but he does have good buffs. I'm not saying he's a bad unit, yet he is getting an Omni and it might toss him in my team. Yet, the, my first seven star was also a Totetsu, which is the funny thing. I don't even have this dude maxed out. I don't have him full int on attack. But yeah. Totetsu was my first 7 star. And my leader for the longest. And then. Because yeah. Since they didn't have that costume thing. At a level 101. The plus 60. I had to. <clears throat> I did grind a bunch. Like literally. I think I got level 90 in 2 weeks. Because. I, this is when they were doing the second year anniversary, like back in October. That's when I started playing, so I had like massive experience boosts. So all I would do is just grind at one area specifically. Like I ignored questing the whole time. Like I think I only got to like Pomnia, Palm, Pomnia, <laughs> however the hell you pronounce it, Pomnia. <clears throat> I just grinded at Mount Lestoria over and over and over again until I just got super high level <clears throat> I mean yeah it was boring and all but it took me a long time <laughs> because what I had to do is I had to get all the way to like level 208 just to get a full team of 7 stars which did take a long time honestly but then then <sighs> The sadder thing was, I had no idea what mitigators were. It's like, as you can tell by this team, there's no mitigator whatsoever. I had no idea what a mitigator was. Uh, it just makes me think back, like, why was I so stupid? It's like, I had no idea what mitigators were. I just decided to roll with the squad because the squad actually went through all the quests perfectly fine without taking much damage. Which, I was surprised myself. Well, f for me especially, because I had no idea what mitigators were, and when I did, I kind of was like, how did this squad even manage to pull it off? <laughs> so I'm just like, I don't know how the, the squad pulled it off. I mean, I do have, like, damage boost, BB gauge. I forgot what Bonnie's 6-star did, but I did have cause status ailments. The I had the four elements, and then I had Selena for the HP recovery. So it means like with buffs like that, 
I kind of went through all of them. And yeah, I did struggle with Maxwell because I had no mitigator. <laughs> it was... Uh, I was literally, literally the worst Brave Frontier player at the beginning. But now it's like... I got everything now. <sighs> but yeah, after this squad, it, it just started... And when I started learning about more stuff, I went and ended up creating this squad when uh, Zorai came out. Whew. 54 summons, man. That was cancer. And then and then Niami and Junoseto came out and Lafil came out and all that. So, like, my team before this, I think it was, well, before Lafil and Junoseto came out. I think Niami came before both of them, I'm pretty sure. I think so I did have uh, bestie and Krantz in and I'm not sure if Niami was released before them but yeah <laughs> so technically that's my story also what I also want to do is um, do like show my inventory thing so like what I have been collecting over the past well I haven't even played that long, honestly. My level is higher than my, um, <laughs> whatchamacallit, how do I look at records? Than my current do days logged in. <laughs> 239 days, man. I'm only 328. Uh, I grinded my ass off. I grinded my ass off in this game. But yeah, I had this squad and now, it's just this squad now. All Omnis, LaFil is still there, but... I don't want to use Magris, honestly, because, I mean, yeah, the two-turn mitigation is good, but, uh, the fill is waifu. <laughs> but, yeah, to back to what I was saying about the view of my inventory thing, yeah, let's get on with that. So, yeah, I do have the, my, all my fodder units off. Uh, do I have the evolution stuff off, too? Yeah, Okay. So technically, I'm just going to show you guys like the whole unit inventory, item inventory, spheres, maybe arena and raid, I don't know. Whatever just comes to mind for me. So yeah, I technically have like all of the new units. I don't have some of the uh, old units, like I guess you could say the majority of them. And also like the special ones. And yes, I do have five Mifuns. I am waiting <laughs> for his dumb Omni to come out. It's taking so long. I also have five Besties, five Avants. I don't know why. I just, I just decided to collect Barbados because I was raiding a shit ton on his thing. Yeah. I do have four Kalooks. Yet, I don't know if I want to raise another one. And then there's Mako. And then Randolph, the Valentine's exclusive unit. That was hard. And then I also have... I only have two Azurais. Where's my other one? <laughs> I think that was a glitched one then. <laughs> I don't know then. Because I remember I have three. <laughs> and then, yeah. I I raised a second Selena because for Arena. But I <laughs> it ended up not working at all. Because I'd had to switch between Lexita because Selena is in my squad and I do use her quite often so yeah and then yeah I have th four Verns too but I need to raise one for Arena specifically but I'm too lazy honestly on that and then yeah just going browsing through all my units I'm surprised I even have this much honestly Thing. I didn't even, it's like, this is my account, but I don't even recognize how much units I actually have. It's sad. <laughs> yeah, and my five Nemeth gears. Oh, yeah. I forgot I kept another Krantz. My Krantz is even maxed out, honest. I don't know. I don't, I decide not to imp anything. I have four Siriuses, so it needs to get pretty serious up in here. <laughs> Bad jokes, man. I have five Junosettos. I have five Sakura Mikus. Oh god. Four, four Lens. I do have five Kikuris, but I'm not sure if I want to raise all of them. Because I, when, in Challenge Arena, when 
it was still out. Freaking a full team of kicker just kicked my ass. Like, jeez. I have three Lucas. <laughs> three Chromes. I have five Ensatias. I have four Niamis. And then I also have five Hatterons, as you can tell. But damn. Oh, yeah. I also got this guy. Freaking Mirfa. Took like 90 plus runs just to get one. <laughs> it was kind of annoying, honestly, but. Eh. But yeah, that's that suits the um, the freaking units. But wait until you guys see my inventory; it's loaded with crap. Yeah, all my Fujin potions, a shit ton of cures, lots of divine lights, and all that stimulates holy water, defense potions, the all the ores, the seals, the stones, the Aries flutes, all the raid items. And green grass. All the grass you need in your life. The feathers, the nuts, the drops. That sounded way weirder than I expected it to be. Claws, fangs, eyes, like geez, pelts, <laughs> bugs, stones. Geez. And then like all the um, the event drops. Like the uh, the one for Christmas, the one for Easter, the lunar one, whatever that one was. I forget what that one was. The uh, <laughs> the April Fool's one. I still have a lot of void chunks, yet I don't need them at all. I still need to beat freaking uh, Lugnia's freaking grand quest i don't know how you get that last achievement i've been trying to do it multiple times but i can't get it and then yeah here are all my spheres i do have quite a damn lot the i wish they made the saint patrick's day sphere a lot better like instead of increased resistance to status ail ailments oh god i can't talk like just like negate them completely it would be a lot better and a bit more useful and then, yeah, all these extra spheres for crafting, like, the Buffer Jewel, Malice Jewel, uh, which, what's that another one called? The Born Jewel? I think that's the 45%. Yeah, I just have all these just for those reasons, just in case. And then, yeah, all my stat spheres. <laughs> and I do have the Nirvana, Nirvana Crown. I'm getting no work. I am nowhere close to the Leto, the Leto crown. I don't even know what the Leto crown does. I might search it up later. I have, yeah, I have two. I only have two heavenly buds, sadly. I should favorite that. <laughs> yeah, I have so many spheres, man. It's like my inventory's not even full yet, and I'm pretty sure like a fifth of my inventory are just all spheres. Yeah. This dragon eye is a really good sphere. Uh, what what other spheres are pretty good? Uh, I do have like all the um, when you beat the Ishgria bosses, I do have all those spheres too. The Demon Striker, Demon Silk, Demon Igniter, and then all the what you might call it, Grand Guy Chronicles. Yeah, those those spheres. <clears throat> yeah. And then I only have a few from the, uh, whatchamacallit, Frontier Gate from these. And then these ones are also from Coliseum. I'm only on 21, so I'm not that far. Yeah, and then my achievements, man. Oh, wait, Trials. I still haven't done Gazia. I'm going to do it soon. I still can't be Lucius, sadly, and I'm like this high level and I have all the new units. And then in Ariel, I haven't even attempted his trial yet, but I gotta do that soon. Yeah, records. They think the only main one is from the, uh, the missions. Yeah, I have gone through the majority of them. Yeah, it's gonna take me quite a while to get to this point. <laughs> I mean, maybe if I keep summoning, I get a shit ton. 
Yeah, Leto Crown. I'm nowhere close to that. I'm like halfway there, but it's going to take a lot longer than that. And then Frontier Hunter. I'm only 25. Dude, I I really haven't paid attention much to Frontier Hunter, so it's like I don't really do it much. But Oh yeah, and I also do have my friend list nearly full. I mean, I have five more. I mean, if you want to add me, for a, feel free to pause the video right now. But, yeah. Okay, so... If you guys want to see my arena record, take a look at my arena record, man. 2,024 wins, zero losses. Like, jeez. <laughs> but I'm such... I'm still pretty low ranking, honestly. <laughs> I'm still pretty low. And this is the squad I use. <laughs> All hit count squad. Ragan with his leader skill adding more hit count. And then all the other four all have hit count extra skills. So they're just doing like double the hit count. I'm just waiting until Mufun comes out. And then that won't be really much of a thing anymore. <laughs> see. Total entries, total wins. I've lost a lot of defense ones. <laughs> See? I have lots, man. And then my Coliseum team. I wouldn't say it's the best, but... I mean, these are the units I'm using, but... Like, this... I mean... I have won a few times with these squads. But I have lost... I did lose, like, seven in a row yesterday. Which kind of frustrated the crap out of me because I was on a like a eight zero win streak, so I was just like, "This is making me salty." But what else is there to show you guys? Oh, there's not really much anymore. But anyway, guys. Anyways, guys, I'm still tired from talking earlier. I did like three pre-recordings of Kadawa Shoujo, so yeah, my throat is still pretty dry from that. <laughs> But anyways, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video, and thanks so much for 100 subscribers. I actually never thought I was going to get to 100. I mean, that's like saying me never getting to a million, I mean, I probably will never reach, see the light for that yet. I mean, it's possible, but, eh, it's, it will take kind of a long time, man, especially. Oh yeah, and a note. <sighs> Actually, I'll say this in a different video, honestly. But anyways, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys later. Thanks for 100 subs, guys. As you can see by the summon, yeah, I will be doing some yellow summons because... I mean, I already have three Azurais, but I wouldn't mind another one. Especially since one of them, are, one of them is Oracle. One is Breaker, one is Guardian. I wouldn't mind an animal one, but I uh, highly doubt I will get one. But anyways, guys, I have something to say while I do the summons, too. So so what what I'm saying is, what I'm going to say is, I will do a Q&A also for my 100 subs. Because I feel like you guys do not know me enough. So if you guys would like to know anything about me, just toss it in the comment section. Ragan. No need. Uh, no rainbow. <laughs> oh, this isn't going to be Azra at all. I mean, I wouldn't mind getting another one, but it, at least Anima, but... I mean, I wouldn't mind another Breaker. But... Who knows? <clears throat> Bad. And what? nope, <laughs> no luck. <laughs> okay, that technically finishes. Oh, 